Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. What leaders should learn from the FAA Safety Summit, a best practice in crisis management, is to proactively find ways to prevent or mitigate a potential crisis. The Federal Aviation Administration appeared to have embraced this best practice yesterday at its first safety summit in 14 years. The headline-grabbing event can serve as a model for business leaders on the steps they should take to reduce the risk of a crisis in their businesses and organizations. The FAA Safety Summit was marked by the recent spate of near misses on the runways at several airports in the United States. Initial information indicates that more errors than usual are occurring throughout the system, on runways, at gates while planes are backing up, in control towers and on flight decks, Bidigiag said at a Federal Aviation Administration Safety Summit. Bidigiag told the summit the air system of the country, UMGNG a disaster following several aviation near misses over the past year. We can t wait for the next disaster event if we can see the warning signs today, reported NBC News. The FAA said it is looking at opportunities to address areas where the existing safety system could be tightened, including looking for new technology to warn air traffic controllers when planes and other vehicles are on a collision course with runways and, according to CNN Runways, the FAA has called on the industry to help identify technologies that could augment existing surface surveillance device capabilities and deploy this technology at all airports with air traffic control services. The agency said, Yesterday's session was attended by 200 airline and security professionals who participated in a series of breakout groups. Sessions focused on commercial operations, the air transportation system, airport and ground operations, and general aviation operations. Each group was assisted by an industry member and an FAA subject matter expert, the FAA reported. Acting FAA Administrator Billy Nolan urged the industry to look at all aspects of its 